Yeah, engineer is important, but at the end of the day, it's about the driver, not the car. True, the great drivers always rise to the top. Wouldn't you agree, fellow world champion? Yeah, you could have put Senna on the lawnmower and he'd still find a way to win. Oh dear, the lift seems to have broken. Let us out! We've got a race to get to! Patience, Lewis. To be a great driver, sometimes you have to think your way around a problem. Em, um, what do you know about driving? You may not know this gentleman, but I was a driver once. Uh-oh, he's going to tell us a story. Oh yes, I had my shot at that championship. It was Brookwood in 62, but that year I was beaten to the title by a young German called von Richtmacher. Victory was cruelly snatched from my grasp. Fascinating. Now about this lift. Maybe I can hotwire this thing. I know what you're thinking. I must have been bitterly disappointed. But I did have another shot at the title. In 1975. Once again, I was foiled by Von Richtmacher. My German rival was making me look like an idiot. Right. How you doing, Lewis? Not happening, man. I ain't gonna fit through this hole. But I did have one last shot at the title. It was the early 80s. I was no longer a young man, but I had a certain... sophistication. I knew this was my last chance to beat my rival, so I made damn sure I'd win. Tell me you didn't mess with his car. Of course not. I'd never do that to a fellow racer. But let's just say he had a little trouble getting to the race. He got stuck in a lift. With a little help. <clears throat> and that, gentlemen, is the value of engineering. Now, I believe you have a race to attend. Respect, Prof. Awesome. <laughs>